Stellantis, the transatlantic automaker formed from the merger of Fiat Chrysler Automobiles and PSA Group, has made an offer to the United Auto Workers, UAW, seeking the right to sell its North American headquarters in Auburn Hills, Michigan. This move has sparked speculation about the company's future plans for the iconic facility. Contrary to concerns that Stellantis may be abandoning Auburn Hills, the sale of the headquarters does not necessarily indicate such intentions. Instead, the automaker is seeking the unilateral right to sell the property as part of a broader restructuring strategy. This includes the potential sale or closure of 18 facilities across North America. The proposed sale of the Auburn Hills headquarters, as well as the technical center located within the same complex, is seen as a strategic move by Stellantis. By divesting itself of certain assets, the company aims to streamline its operations and focus on its core business areas. The Auburn Hills headquarters has long been associated with Stellantis and its predecessor companies, housing key functions such as executive offices, research and development, and engineering. Known for its iconic presence, the facility has played a significant role in the company's operations in North America. While Stellantis has not disclosed specific details about the potential sale or any interested buyers, industry experts believe that the unique features and prime location of the Auburn Hills headquarters could attract considerable interest. This property could present a valuable investment opportunity for a range of businesses operating in the automotive or technology sectors. As Stellantis embarks on this restructuring journey, Decisions regarding facility closures or divestitures are driven by a variety of factors, including market conditions, operational efficiency, and the company's overall strategy. The UAW will be a key stakeholder in these discussions, as any changes will have an impact on its members' jobs. It is important to note that while the potential sale of the Auburn Hills headquarters represents a significant development, it does not signify a complete abandonment of the region by Stellantis. The company remains committed to its operations in Auburn Hills and its iconic Jeep brand, which plays a vital role in its North American market presence. In summary, Stellantis' offer to the UAW seeking the right to sell its Auburn Hills headquarters as part of the company's broader restructuring strategy. This move aims to streamline operations and focus on core business areas. While the sale may raise questions about the company's future plans, it does not indicate a complete departure from Auburn Hills. The facility's iconic status and prime location make it an attractive investment opportunity for potential buyers in the automotive and technology sectors. The outcome of these discussions will have implications for Stellantis' workforce and the UAW.